Put your hands together for John Bromnick. I'm watching shows all night. They're looking for Bigfoot. <laughs> They're looking for the Loch Ness Monster. I've been watching these shows for 25 years. 25 years. They don't have one decent picture of Bigfoot. Not one decent picture of the Loch Ness Monster. They got some squiggly thing. You see the trees are moving. I hear something. Nothing. 25 years. But they're just about to get Bigfoot. But you always hear this. They take somebody out of their bed in the middle of the night. The person's taken to a spaceship. They take the blood out. They analyze the blood. They put the person right back in their bed. Those people are never from New Jersey. <laughs> They're always from like Arkansas. <laughs> Can you imagine if they took Tony from Bayonne out of his bed <laughs> in the middle of the night? There'd be four missing Martians. <laughs> There'd be a knock on the door. Bayonne police. Yes, I can help you. Uh, Tony, what's the deal with the spaceship in the driveway? Hey, got it as a Christmas present. You got a problem with that? <laughs> the cops look in. What about those four guys, those little guys with the antennas that were tied up on the couch? Those are my cousins. You got a problem with that? And then I opened my law practice in Plainfield. Now, when I tell you I knew nothing about practicing law, zero. I put a sign on Depot Park, I put a desk in there, and I waited for my first client. First client, murderer walks in. I said, oh, jeez. I took the case. <laughs> the jury was out for five minutes. They came back guilty, first degree murder. I turned to my client, I said, Mom? <laughs> Uh, you know, we should really thank the state police and local police. A few months ago, they solved that issue with those terrorists who tried to blow up the New Jersey Shore, right? Right down to Seaside Park, where Michelle Obama is from. Now, can you imagine how stupid these terrorists are trying to blow up the New Jersey Shore? That is sacred property. That's sacred land in New Jersey. So guess what? We change our tactics. We go on Jersey on the terrorists. You know at the Lincoln Tunnel and the Holland Tunnel where you got those Port Authority cops? They're out. We hired the squeegee men. <laughs> what you gonna do when the squeegee guys are looking in your car, right? Like this. They don't need no probable cause. <laughs> and at the airports, those TSA people, all due respect, they can't find a gun when it's sitting up on the conveyor belt. Not personal. And they ain't exactly the nicest guys in the world. They're screaming at you, take your shoes off, take your belt off. They are out. We are putting Jersey moms there. <laughs> Jersey mom takes one look, goes like that. That guy is no good. I tell you something, and they're always right. Might take a year or two, but your mom goes, I told you, I told that guy no damn good. Get rid of him. That's what I would do.